Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you some work from home jobs where you can get paid a thousand dollars a week to basically just send emails all day long. So there's a company called InkSub. You may have heard me mention them before, but they are a company that specializes in WordPress products and services. And so they deal a lot with websites and different projects that have to do with websites. And you can find their careers by going to the top right of InkSub.com. This is a company that actually hires worldwide. So if you're outside the US, you can apply here for pretty much any job they have available. Most positions they have here are fully remote, have the flexibility to work wherever you'd like. They offer competitive rates, 28 to 35 days of paid time off per year, paid travel to WordCamps and other benefits and perks that we'll go over more in a minute. They have a WordPress support specialist at Campus Press available right now. This is 1 p.m. to 9 p.m. UTC on a schedule. Now they don't tell you you have to be in the UTC time zone as far as your physical location. That's just your hours. So don't worry about that. 40 hours per week, full-time hours in the technical support industry. So it is a full-time position. You're working completely remote. And this job involves providing support by email to EduBlogs and Campus Press customers, assisting with and solving all manner of WordPress questions with style, contributing to testing and QA with updates to WordPress core plugins and themes, coordinating with developers over bugs, features, and cool new stuff, and then being an active part of the Ink Sub team. So qualifications for this job include, you need to have a really good familiarity with WordPress, maybe even able to code, which includes things like PHP, MySQL, HTML, and CSS, which are basically coding languages for building websites. And experience in WordPress multi-site networks would be great as well. Amazingly great communication skills, impressive response times, and typing speed. You can test your word per minute typing speed at typingtest.com if you need to. Um, interpersonal skills, including the power to swiftly build rapport with both current and potential customers. Great team player, keen on working on expanding motivated distributed support team. Enjoy collaborating with others and don't back down from a challenge and love people and love yourself. Now they also mention the benefits that come with this job as well. So this includes flexibility, very attractive working conditions for the right candidate, 28 days paid leave per year up to 35, opportunities for paid travel to attend WordCamps and other industry conferences, long service leave which is three months off paid after you've been with them for a while up to two months salary bonus based on company growth targets technology budgets every three years the longer you serve the higher you deserve and general expenses budget yearly the longer you work the more you get and the long service leave i believe that's what most companies would call a sabbatical so other than that that's pretty much it for this job this is the only job they have available right now. As far as reviews from their employees, they gave it a 3.8 out of five star rating for working here. 62% recommend working here to a friend. And then as far as how much you might be able to make here, we do have a job that's somewhat similar to this, which is a hosting support job. So another type of customer support, probably for one of their WordPress hosting products, which is up to 57,000 a year, averaging around 45, but you have the option, you have the ability, if you can get up to around 50 plus thousand a year or so, then you're up to that, you know, pretty close to a thousand dollars a week. Now, as far as benefits at this company, they have nine people that have left feedback. Two gave it a five star rating, or not a five star rating, but they gave it a star rating and they gave it a four out of five star overall rating between the two people. And obviously it's a small sample size, so it's hard to draw a lot of conclusions from that. As far as the interview process, they do have a 3.1 out of 5 star rating and a, you know, a good chunk of people had a positive experience here. Some people had a negative experience and then some people had neutrals. Fairly even between positive and negative, so probably about average, I guess. And then for customer support related jobs, you do have one person that said they were a support specialist or support hero, something like that is what you would want to look for. Um, this person said they were asked about their end of year and Christmas, so obviously not really very helpful there. Um, support hero, they used to call like their customer support jobs something like that. It's like a support superhero or something. Um, this one, they said they were asked to tell about themselves, what kind of hobbies you have, and how do you spend time. 
So they might want to get to know you personally a little bit instead of just asking you job related questions. Hopefully this was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell if you want more daily work from home opportunities like these and I'll see you in the next video.